Hello, and welcome back to the Mini World Let's Play. I'm, so I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry for the, you know, not uploading during July because I was kind of busy. With some of the stuff that I was doing, and also finding the perfect time to like record stuff. Um, for those who um, have not watched the first episode, um. Mania World is a um, Sonic themed Minecraft world, and you play the levels and stuff like that. You parkour and stuff like that. I can't believe I, I took I have to put in my Minecraft disc. Well, I mean I have to take out the what was it my disc that I was on currently in the PlayStation and then didn't inject, so like I had to like take off the face plates, accidentally cut myself, and here we are, um, doesn't matter, anyways, let's, before I make this intro very long, um, let's go to Speed Highway. Speed Highway, um, yeah, the modern... Well, not modern, um, Dreamcast era. I wasn't... Pl originally, I wasn't planning to, like, do Dreamcast and stuff like that. But, like, I just let it slide. It was going to be, like, what was it? A Minecraft... Which is Sonic Mania Minecraft world. An actual one. But it later turned into, like, some sort of Sonic Generations world. No big deal. I don't care. Um... I barely didn't even make any of any of Dreamcast levels. Cause all I did was just make Green Hill and nothing else. I can't believe we're already already right here. And it was this part. This is supposed to be when you're like falling down. Apparently Shadow didn't do that. Oops. That wasn't supposed to happen, but apparently Shadow didn't even do that, so. Yeah. Anyways, this is now the day section. Um, this part was like shorter. You would like like have to go over here. I don't know why this door is open, but you would have to like go over here and then find the capsule, which used to be here, but you know. And now there's an extended part. Oh look. Mm. This was added um in the update new one. Now we have to go up here. And there's a lever. Now once the lever is activated, we go over here. So cool. Ah, uh, cave sound. And we did it. Oops. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> that quick. I should like open these doors so like. So I can make sure that I already did the level. Anyways. We did that. Now it's time for city escape. In the nighttime. This part was kind of clever. So. Minecraft physics, of uh, my cart physics seems to be, I don't know, change. But, um, city, city escape, the opening part made sense because, you know, this, the, whenever you, um, skateboard off, uh, at the beginning. Anyways, we got the Chaos Emerald. Apparently, it's, it's different between those. All chaos and we'll see H A O S C H A O S E M E R A L D E M E R A L D they're the same. What what makes these different? I can't tell. Anyways, we got third chaos emerald. 
Yeah, third Chaos Emerald. Alright. I wish some of these, um, levels in the Dreamcast era were, like, at least a little bit longer. I mean, I could have done that in, like, in this update, but, like, I don't want to, like, make another update where I just make some of the Dreamcast levels longer. I mean, Metal Harbor is long enough, and City Escape, which was claimed to be claimed around in the group chat to be like the longest level in this world. I think that um later changed to um Hidden Palace being the longest level in this world. Anyways, we did City Escape. So cool. Now I think about it, I could probably do the Dreamcast era and the modern modern era which has two zones. Anyways, Metal Harbor. I thought I fucked that up. I mean, anyways, Metal Harbor. Um, originally, Metal Harbor was like some short thing. If you've seen is some, what was it? Some trailers. Metal Harbor was um kind of short. Up. And this is why we do slash kill. See. But yeah, Metal Harbor, um... No. Metal Harbor was, um, very short. Um, the reason why is I don't know, but if I can assume Shadow didn't, like, feel like, you know, making Metal Harbor an actual level. It was supposed to be a quote-unquote minigame. And then I got, and I, um... And I, some kind of future, some kind of update during, like... 1.1? Shit. During 1.1, I think I took the job of doing Metal Harbor. Actually making Metal Harbor a natural stage. And I did. I incorporated some parts of Metal Harbor. You will that you will see eventually. But for whatever reason, I made the Parkour in Metal Harbor is so stupid, like, four block jumps. I don't like that. One, two, three. There, I made that part. But eventually, yeah, this part is one of them. Fuck! So, like, these, do you, jeez, these jumps are, like, possible. It's just that I made them too hard. I could like fix it. I could fix it whenever I get the money for like Minecraft Realms so I can like update it. Because I don't don't have it currently. <sighs> oh, there we go. See, I told you. I made that part. But once we go here, there, I made that one. Ah, oh, fuck that up. I wasn't so sure about the jump. Anyways, back to Metal Harbor. I really like Metal Harbor from like um, Sonic Adventure 2. Um, pretty one of my favorite um action levels. Um, Green Forest being the being one in the being number one. Huh. Apparently, I lost connection to my Wi-Fi while recording this. Doesn't affect anything. Fuck. Doesn't affect anything, but still. I mean, it's kind of like, it's 2 a.m. And these are like the only times I have the... These are like the perfect time to like record these types of stuff. So yeah. I mean, it's the perfect time to record these types of stuff, as long as I'm not interrupted by someone just coming in, in the door. I mean, I could clip that out, but like, still. I want to like, make sure this is like, one take. 
not like I have to cut these out because that would be annoying. I can't believe I'm having trouble with this. I'm gonna keep on doing this until I actually, I actually, um, fucking make this jump. Because I know this jump is possible. It's just that I'm fucking... Yeah. Can't believe the difficulty just spiked up in the fucking Dreamcast era. If I ever monetize these videos, probably, probably, um, they will be demonetized because I'm just saying these slurs. Okay, there we go. And that should be the last annoying thing. Okay, this part, this is when, um, you're supposed to, like, what was it, roll into, roll into these sections. And it's supposed to, like, be, like, you're supposed to go up. It's like, you have to grab something and then you're supposed to go up. Okay, these jumps aren't bad. These are like three block jumps. Okay, now we did Metal Harbor. This this part is supposed to be when you're like going off this um, the shuttle or spaceship or the shuttle, yeah. And then this part is when you like go down. And we did it. We did Metal Harbor. And that's it for Metal Harbor. All right. Seaside Hill. Now Seaside Hill. I should have taken the minecart. This one ain't bad compared to like Metal Harbor, but like Seaside Hill. Um, Seaside Hill. Um, it's something. All right. Seaside Hill, um, if you go here, um, there was supposed to be, like, what was it, a special stage, when special stage were, like, originally planned. I want to do, uh, like, oh yeah, this used to be a ring to get one of, one of the Chaos Emeralds, also use of fat, we have found another use of fat sign. Or, I don't know if the blue text is, um, counts as use of fat signs, that has use of fat, anyways. This is, like, the only... The only impressive part of Seaside Hill. Um, once again, Seaside Hill was one of those kind of short levels in um, the Mania world. Like it would be all the way here to that to that building, and that's it. That was Seaside Hill. Like you would like you would like end the level right here. In the stone pillar, where where it would be um, a gold ring so you can jump into, but no, I decided to like make it longer. Okay. I'm actually not taking the shortcut. This part it was supposed to be from generations, but um, clearly you can't see if it was from generations. Um, if I'm being honest, I wish I made Seaside Hill no good, but I like, I kind of fucked it up, kind of messed it up. And all it took was just one try to finish Seaside Hill, compared to the Metal Harbor. Um, yeah. That was Seaside Hill, and the end of the Dreamcast era. Now I'm not ending the video short. So, we're doing the modern era, which consists of two levels. As seen here. Yawn. What happened? There's only two zones here. Alright. So. There used to be, like, a third modern level, but it wasn't considered a modern level because, well, it wasn't from any of the Sonic games. It was, like, an original zone. I could have um, been in the, what was it? The 
new the new zones. Anyways, this is Lost Valley from Forces as seen here. And th and this is a level where you would have um get the soul emeralds from like I said from last time. Yeah, this was originally Green Hill Modder until later on Shadow decided to like until Shadow decided to like um make it Lost Valley from forces. Um, he did an alright job, I guess. Not saying it's bad, but like... Lost Valley. Anyways, this is like... This is the second green hill in this level. In this world. And then we're gonna encounter the third green hill. these jumps because if I can remember there was like a part where you need like the speed potion and honestly I did not want to do that honestly it's Minecraft. no get back over here but like I said um I removed some of the speed potion parts because it just um slows you down and then you speed up like why well, you want to like take a break and then just speed up but only um you go faster more I mean mm. yeah I told you this part was possible and it was just that little jump okay that one too This is where Lost Valley Park begins. Because if I assume it, it stopped right there. If I can recall. Um, sorry for the hold up guys, um, uh, one of my family members just came into the room, but I, I, I did said I wanted to do this in one take, but we're like this close, and like I don't want, oops, cave sound, but like we're this close, and like I don't want to fuck things up. Anyways, here's the fourth, here's the fourth chaos I rolled. That damn fourth chaos I rolled. I think there's an achievement for finding the damn fourth chaos I rolled. And here's the, um, well, the star, apparently, from Forces. Um, we're here. Let me check if there was an achievement for the 4th Chaos Emerald. Because I remember before there was an uh, achievement for the 4th Chaos Emerald. Um, let's see here. Yep. This was, a. Uh, this was, um, this was there. It's always been theirs. It's just that these are these are the new achievements and like, you know. Like, this was when you couldn't even edit signs. And it was like... Yeah. Splash Hill Zone, guys. The third green hill. This is unbelievable. Three green hills in my Minecraft world? Unacceptable. But if I could... Yeah, all of the Sonic 1 Episode 1 levels are here. Not a single Episode 2 level is, is in this world. And it was Splash Hill Zone. Or Splash Hill Act 1. Kind of sucks that the um, what was it the JJ Wiki um shut down because of inactivity. Thanks, fandom. 
but because of that, it got because it got taken down once again. I plan on like moving it elsewhere, like I don't know a Wix website. I already set this in the my server, and we're already in Act Two. But I set this in my server that I wanted to like move the wiki to a different place because if it's going to keep on, um, you know. Being shut down due to inactivity, I might as well just move that, move it elsewhere, and also the ads. But like, Manual World was like one of the, one of the pages in the wiki, and had some like information that was useful for me to like, I don't know, look back to, and also the trailers. But I still have them in Brant DMs, so like. They're still unlisted, the old Mania World trailers. I can just go to his DMs and like grab those trailers whenever I plan on work on the wiki. But yeah. Uh yeah, Mania World was um Mania World was like one of the pages in the wiki and that's about it. Add some like actual good information such as like the DLC and mainly some documented information, mainly about the history. But that's about it. Uh, Splash Hill. Okay, um. Splash Hill just doesn't become Splash Hill right after Act 2. It just becomes this. I don't know why. There's, this is why we grab these ladders. The only time when we needed to do that and fax it. Now we don't need these ladders. I'll just put these in my inventory. Now I guess you can say we could have used these ladders to like make this part like make this part like easy. But yeah, this is supposed to be Splash Hill Act 3, but fucking, this is a very short Act 3. And then this part, um, well, some of the trailers had this part where it would be like, it would be on fire. There was like some kind of like circles around it. It would be on fire. It was on fire. It was on um, Netherrack. And there was like some flames and then you have to make sure you like, don't hit the fire and like hit this slime block over here. Well, that's Splash Hill with a gold ring, with a gold ring from those games instead of a signpost. But yeah, that was Splash Hill. It took that long. And now that we did it, this is the end of the video so cool. I finally recorded Dreamcast era along with modern era. Uh, yeah. Stay tuned for the modern era. <laughs> Hopefully I don't get it out next month. Which that being September around the around recording this video, this is August 2nd. 2.55 a.m. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please like the video, comment in the in the video saying something. I don't know, <laughs> and subscribe. And see you guys another time. Goodbye.